Yo, 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 yo. So a couple weeks ago, Jideon dropped the hairline reveal where he had this brand new hairline. Super dope. Now, I was wondering where can I get a hairline like that? So I browsed the internet and I found one place where I could customize the hair just like Jideon's. It's exactly what Jideon used in the video. So I placed an order. It's coming in today. And I just can't wait to go grab it and uh, show you guys what's in the kit. After we open the kit, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some time, I'm gonna try to find a model, somebody to put it on, and see if we can get similar results to Jideon, like a crazy makeover like Jideon's. Because I'm gonna show you step by step how I believe Jideon got his hairline back. Stay tuned. It's here, it's here. I'm gonna unbox this. Can't wait, hold on. Here we go, baby. There it is. So guys, I have the receipt on my phone. I'll pull up a screen recording of the receipt that I have on my phone so you guys can see how much it costed, all the details, whatnot. And uh, yeah, we're gonna, gonna take that do-rag and head off right now. So I know a lot of you guys probably aren't subscribed to this channel, please subscribe. I bring people's hairlines all the way back. If you like the video, like it, and leave a comment if you have any questions, anything at all. There is no secrets here. We're gonna tell you everything step-by-step -step process, how Gideon got his hairline back. Stay tuned. There's a lot of people that have, as Gideon would say, a clapped hairline, a hairline that is, is just receding or going back or their hair just doesn't look the way they want it to anymore so my job is to really not only bring you back to who you were but more importantly push you to who you want to be how you want to represent yourself so that's the importance of hair in this situation so i'm going to break this down for you step by step so that you can see everything that you guys didn't see in the youtube live that jideon provided you guys um, there's a lot that happens So first we're gonna start with creating the hairline. So as you can see our client right here similarly to Jideon is experiencing Male pattern baldness and they're losing a lot of hair missing a lot of hair So where does his hairline need to be for him to look? The best okay, so we draw that on okay Let's just imagine because he already has a hair tattoo So we have a guideline for where we're gonna put this hairline already but if he didn't, we would draw it on. Basically, you want to keep it just above the wrinkles on the forehead because those are muscles and, and nobody has a hairline on the muscles on their forehead. So once we draw the hairline on, then we'll proceed to cutting the areas that have the most recession or the, the, the thinning the most. Get rid of those hairs that you really don't need. And those are the that's the area that we're going to really essentially cover up. Once that cut's complete, we're gonna do the fade on the sides. Get them nice and clean and tight. Um, similarly to Jideon, this client right here, he wanted a nice mid fade. And, and that's exactly what we gave him. Nice, crispy, clean. Next, we're gonna apply the glue. All right. Um, we're gonna apply a couple coats of this. Now for this to work well, the adhesive, the glue, needs to dry clear. If it does not dry clear, it will not stick well to the hair that we are gonna stick onto his head. Now, what I wanna tell you about this hair that we're gonna stick onto his head is, with the hair and with this adhesive, he will be able to swim, shower, work out, do what he wants, all right? This hair had waves in it. Unfortunately, the client told me he never had waves in his life and he does not want any waves. So, um, I'm gonna, comb them out brush them out so we're gonna apply the unit I typically go front to back so I lay the front down first and gently roll it back making sure that there is no creases there's no little wrinkles in the base of the unit as I'm rolling it back now it's rolled back it's crispy clean it looks like a big afro it looks a little wacky right now but trust me guys we're getting to the point of no return where your confidence is at another level where you won't won't ever want to go back we're gonna 
cut the excess areas that are not sticking to his head just cut those away get rid of them and then we're gonna go into getting this top part just trimmed down a little better and we're just gonna start cutting and blending it in and then we're gonna lay that hairline down and get to lining it up this is very important as you know Gideon talks about the hairline more than he talks about the actual hair the hairline is everything so we're gonna go work from middle to side middle to other side and then just clean up the whole thing make sure it's nice sharp crispy clean and I'm gonna give you guys I'm gonna give you guys like a, maybe a minute to look at this this finished product because it absolutely looks incredible look at this look at this I mean that's it you know what I mean this process took two hours again he can work out he can shower he can sweat he can um, swim with it uh, if he were to swim, for example, I would maybe prescribe him a different type of glue or adhesive that can hold up stronger under those conditions. But the unit doesn't just fly off your head. That's not how it works. Um, it really it just doesn't do that. Now, I'd appreciate if you guys like this video, like, comment, subscribe. I can do another video actually on maybe another one of these YouTubers. Uh, there was one, I wanted one on chunks. You know what, I feel sorry for you. For that, I'm going to give you a paper. You take it, do you go? Oh, la. Wow. Because I have a, a, a client that has similar features to chunks. And I think that could be a cool video to do next. But let me know in the comments. Did you like this video? Do you have any questions? Because I'm trying to answer all the questions that were in the initial video. Because everybody thought it was a hair transplant. But it's not a hair transplant. This is how you get the best results I, I understand a lot of people like hair transplants but that's a surgery and you can't really confirm those results stylistically i mean you can guarantee in a lot of cases that you'll grow your own hair out of your head but style wise you guys got to understand there's a reason women use weaves use wigs and this is the type of thing where i've had clients that didn't even have hair loss they just want to switch up the style they didn't have the patience to grow up their hair or do certain things to their hair so they came they got this done two hours later they're fresh out of the chair and they look exactly how they want to look if you know anybody who has a clapped hairline share this with them i'm bringing everybody all the way back it's clap back season shout out to Gideon because that's exactly if you guys ever if you're in a situation like Gideon with the hairline like that that you want to change that is how you're supposed to react the level of confidence that he's running with is the level of confidence that most people have when they put on a new hairline the challenge is a lot of people are thinking too much about what other people think and are not expressing how happy they are about themselves. So it's always about what's in you, not what's on the outside. And then his barber, which doesn't seem to get as much love, but he deserves it. Billico is a monster. He is amazing with it, as you can see with Gideon's results. And if you need anything from me specifically, if you liked the work we did in that last video, you guys can just definitely click on the link in the description or below we supply hair to everybody we train people so if you wanted to say do this on yourself or do this for fun or do this as a profession we can train you and we also provide the service so hit the link in the description below it's clapback season it's time to get your hairline back take crumbs make bread damps damps